Previously on Night Bewitch 2, the party defeated the mechanical guardian of Zemase and obtained the first half of the Vulcan Stone. They then went to the snowy continent to look for the second piece, but Ogron still had the grudge against the party and inconveniently had a fortress on the only path to their destination. Is that the Assassin's Hut? Yep, there's an event the moment I go in there, and a grave marker. It's locked. You think this is where that Ash guy lives? It's likely. I'm going to sub out here. Cool, mind if I join you? This might be my only chance to learn from the master. Just don't get in my way. You sure he's going to come out here? We've been waiting forever. He must know you're here. He's probably waiting for you to make the first move. Be quiet. What the hell? Never mind. Start talking. Damn, you were sent to kill me, weren't you? Don't make me repeat myself. Fine, the monarch was controlling us. When she moved to the Null Fortress, I fell behind, and the spell broke. I'm one of the few lucky ones to break free. I was aware of all the atrocities I was committing. I couldn't stop it, and those who could stop were killed. I knew I could never be forgiven. That's why I moved out here, to be alone. I didn't expect it to end like this, but you know what? I'm ready to die. Go ahead, I won't stop you. You're telling the truth. You're free to go. Hey, hold on a second. We can't just let him live. We were hired to kill him. I know the innocent from the guilty. I don't kill innocent people. How do you know he's not just lying to you? He's not. What? You... Right, we're not just gonna let him go, are we? You were lying in wait too, in case he tried to escape, huh? Just how many people were sent to kill me? You remember what that guy in Nivea said about Ash, right? Back me up on this. There's no justice in killing an innocent man. Hmm. I'll side with Uno on this one. I think he can tell when people are lying. How can you take Uno's side on this? We were hired to kill this guy. Sorry, Alex, but I agree with him. I don't like the idea of killing an innocent man even if we were hired to. Man, this is bullshit. Whatever, screw it. Let him live. See if I care. Probably lied about killing him, right? Since there's no way you can confirm his death anyways, right? What'd you tell him? That I took care of it. That's all he needs to know. A very evasive answer. So, Uno, I was wondering. All the stories about you say that you've assassinated hundreds of people, but how many have you really killed? For assassinations. Less than five. Less than five? No way! I'm good at killing, but I don't enjoy it. It was never my goal to begin with. But you're an assassin. I'm so confused. I can understand. It's his reputation that's important, not his actual kill count. Uno's goal isn't to kill bad guys, but rather for bad guys to know that he exists. And that he could appear behind them at any moment. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. 500G and Grandmaster's Belt. They say the reward is supposed to change depending on how I do things, huh? The heck is a Grandmaster Belt? Is that for him? Yup, it's only for him, but... It's an accessory, rather than an enhancer. Spirit Thief skill. Thank you all for taking care of Ashras. Selling him and the Monarch won't make the snow stop falling, but at least we know we're safe now. Alright. Apparently if I had picked the R option, Alex would have gotten, uh, uh, gotten a new ability instead. Hmm. Did I make the right choice? Better not betray me. You're back. You didn't, uh, change your mind, did you? Nope. Besides, we already got the money. Nothing in it for us. Ah, right. You were hired to kill me. I almost forgot that part. You have a cutscene? I still remember the day Mona returned to Nivius. It started snowing the moment she arrived. None of us ha had ever seen snow before. I remember thinking it was beautiful. It wasn't bad at first, you know, but after a week straight of snowfall, Mona's personality started to change. She demanded we refer to her as the Monarch. We thought it was a joke. We even asked her to stop the snow. She didn't like that. She tried mind control at first, couldn't control us all though, so she ordered us to kill anyone who wouldn't bow to her. Like I said before, we were aware the whole time. I remember desperately wanting to close my eyes as I swung the sword. I couldn't stop myself. I ended up killing some kid's parents. And just as it got worse, she decided to pack up and leave. The whole, the whole ordeal lasted less than a month, but ended with over half of Nivius's population dead. I hope you all put her out of her misery soon. 
Uh, Vulcan stone sounds pretty scary. But what if one of us ends up using it? What would happen? Null Fortress. Why are we flying a bunch of, over above a uh, 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 flying above a bunch of trees? And this writing does not seem to say anything. Melody's Cripple Enha Skill Enhancer. Okay, this is horror. Uh, this is a horror game now. Portal is broken. Okay, so we have two paths. Is that pool of blood? Breaker bolts. 15G. Mist potion. Free action potion. Vampire Saber. It's apparently supposed to be bad against the undead. Twenty three G Life Powder Flashbang Skill Enhancer Potent Ether Potent Potion Titan's Brace. Probably just Attack Brace, but better. Or Power Brace, but better. Where's this go? Bookshelves. Sweet Wine. 20G. Stalagmite. Okay. Fall mushroom. Okay, now there's a bunch of blood and the stairs. Where does this go? All the way over here, I see. These threads helpers are just meant to get you closer to your goal. More blood, more sacrifices. The snow calls for your flesh. Come to me. Reaching shout. Flash bang. Hmm. Arrow rain. Deadly haze. Ugh, minions. Promise they act almost Im pretty much immediately upon being summoned. It's just really, really insane. There are too many ailments all at once. My characters are too slow to actually do anything about this. Hmm.
Party Brew. Backstab. Uh, we're starting to make progress, but damn. Spell is just barely doable. Do the all oh, the sheer amount of status effects you have to deal with at the same time. This is definitely way harder than the last game. Okay, another one, but a bit of dust. But yeah, this guy only has one turn left for his star, so that gives me an advantage. Party brew. Okay. Silencing shot and vampire. Pick me up on Rai. Arrow Rain. Hurry Brew. Hmm. Rain. Poison Bomb. Finally, we're getting some momentum back. Mass Eruption. Arrow Rain. Backstab. Okay. Helm Splitter. Party Brew. Rapid Fire, now you're the only one left. And Ambush. Eruption, we can do this. The snow will never stop falling. She was wearing the second half of the stone around her neck. I'll pick it up. We can plan our next move after we leave this place. Wilkinstone half. That was way too... Uh, 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 that was really, really insane due to the sheer amount of enemies and ha making them immortal too. Ugh. Whatever, we got past it. Even if it took a bunch of KOs and items. And there's her bedroom. A shit in her bed for all the trouble she puts through. Hermes Benediction Skill Enhancer. It's really keep a lady waiting, you know. Can you see how cold I am out here? We have both halves of the stone. We've won your little race. Oh my, I forgot about that. This was supposed to be a contest, wasn't it? Oh well, I'm done playing games. 
She's gonna have some kind of cutscene paralysis power? Bro, hand me the stones. What? He was the mole. Hand over Bo Vulcan stone halves. What? Whoa, whoa, we look at that. I was winning the whole time, and you idiots were none the wiser. Shall we be leaving, brother? No, I'm going to stay here. With them, have you become as stupid as they are? Sue yourself. What? Why? Whose side are you on? Why aren't you joining the. Um, they'll kill you, you know? Ta ta! They had this all planned from the very beginning. Gwen, this is our fault, isn't it? We should have known. You didn't even bar finding the mole before f getting the final stone piece. Of course not. We can still fix this. We just have to, um, well... I'm not sure yet, but we'll figure it out. We always do. Just one question, though. What are we going to do with him? No, put me down, please. Let me explain. I can forgive many things, Hermes, but if there's one thing I can't stand, it's being lied to by someone I trusted. You'd better give me a damn good reason before my hand slips. I can tell you where she's going next. That's why I stay here. Oh, isn't that convenient? Right, put him down. We can't just kill him like this. This bastard's been lying to us ever since the day we met. Why the hell should we trust him now? God damn it, I'm tired of being called an idiot. <coughs> Need to interrogate him. Lisa wasn't always like that. We were orphans. I did everything I could to protect her, but she just kept getting worse. Don't tell me she was being influenced by Zamus, just like with Typhus. I tried to help her. Magic, medicine, prayer. Nothing worked. I didn't know what to do. She called it Lilith's blessing. What? Lilith? I f but Lilith was a puppet, right? I never found out what she meant by that. About a year ago, she told me the angel had given her a mission. Join the Cull of Drakon, restore the Vulcan Stones, revive Typhus. She knew exactly where to go. She just needed the resources to get there. And that's where we came in, huh? Yes, I convinced Edmund to form the D Deep Forge Expedition. Lisa and I communicated every step of the way. I told her to let us scatter the stones so she wouldn't get hurt. You put us in harm's way to protect your crazy sister. Wonderful. So now what? Do we just let her get, use the stone and get us all killed? She has a point, Hermes. I don't know how your plan was supposed to go next, but we can't let Lysandra revive Typhus no matter what. We have to stop her even if it's by force. Her last des destination is the Verdon Temple. It's on an island west of here in northeast of Lestonia. We can reach it with Nitaka. Then we have no time to lose. It could be another trap. Why are why did he stay behind? Told you he was screwing with us. Not in the mood, Alex. Meh. That did not have quite the gravity I thought it was gonna have. We don't uh, like the biggest question is what does he plan to do next once we get there? Is he going to side with us or side of his sister again? Okay, at level 28, Uno learns the assassinate skill. Hmm, one use per battle. Deals 235 to enemies below 33% hit points. Good thing your hit point bars are visible, or this would be very impractical to use. Hey, I have all kinds of neat stuff here, but this one is the coolest of all. I don't know what it is, though. It's a thingy with execute written on it. This is gonna cost you a thousand G. Sure, why not? You bought everything I had. Thanks a lot. I'm gonna use all this money to buy new fidget spinners. Hello, you all look like you're not far from uh, not from around here. I could use some help from travelers like yourselves if you're not too busy. I'm an alchemist. I'm attempting to replicate some unique potions I found, but I don't have the ingredients I need to do so. Here's what I need. First, I need green mushroom. They start growing right around the this time of year in Spore Marsh, so I'm sure you can find at least one. Second, I'll need eight sharp claws. Ground-up monster claws have all kinds of different uses. I'm sure you can find these from any enemy that has claws. Lastly, I require an emerald. Hopefully you found one and held onto it, but if not, you might get lucky and have a monster drop one for you. Bring me back these three ingredients and I'll use them to brew up potions you can't buy anywhere else. Thanks. Hmm. Oh, I forgot to grab this last time. Pretty G. Alright, there, apparently there's a scene here. Maybe it's about Hermes and his betrayal. Or not. Or w maybe so. Yes? I am. Um, I wanted to ask for your help with something. Really now? You're asking for help after pulling that stun of yours? 
What if you try to wrestle this in before doing the Null Fortress? Huh, I like that. Go ahead, ask away. You seem far more knowledgeable on magic and science than I am. Do you know of any spell or mixture that could help my sister? Still clinging to hope, I see. I admire that. Your sister's a lucky woman. Alas, there is no cure for insanity. Believe me, I would know. I see, thank you. If there was such a cure, we would have used it on Typhus. Now it's my turn. Why do you ask me a question you already knew the answer to? You're quite the secretive. Uh, you're quite secretive for an altar boy, aren't you? Fine then, keep your secrets. Yes, sir. Uh, and and unfortunately, we have to worry about Mar uh, Morgoth turning evil too. It's a single fungus, but it's going to be strong. Okay, maybe I can try and flick blind on you. Hmm. Venom arrow, I it might be immune because it's already a poison type to begin with. Rupture. Blinded, bleeding, literally everything. Oh boy. Wow, the efficiency charm really is really effective. 2 MP. Just to use her, her best move like that. Soothing mist on everyone. Okay, rapid fire. And they, it actually changed the threshold. It's not 33% anymore, it's 40%. Okay. Backstab. Slow poison, we can't resist that one, huh? Okay. Party brew. Rapid fire. Backstab. Even has regular attacks. Hmm. Ambush. Hemorrhage. Great brew. It's almost there. Double strike. That was way easier than the Monarch, since there's only one enemy we have to deal with. And we got the Green Mushroom! Okay, you can actually see their ship right here. Whoa. Okay, we might end up in a fight at this rate, if their ship is right there and they have people on guard. Full heal. 55G. Life Shaver Skill Enhancer. Potent Potion. 
Tourists are not allowed here. Please leave it. Uh, please leave at once. Holy shit! Free, uh, kill them all free in one hit. Draconic Ward and an another Alduin clone. Flush Bang. He used in power, so I don't think magic attacks will help much. This is bad. I picked the wrong party. Hmm. Flashbang can re be reflected. Shit. Power boost. Arrow rain the gun. Hmm. Let's try blood barrier. Damn it, she got silenced. Soothing Mist. Hero Rain. Ah. One down. Whirlwind. Party Brew. Arrow Rain. Eruption U. There we go. Miss Potion. Pretty G. Marauder Curas. Potent but Ether. Come at me, Skill Enhancer. Pretty G. Goal. Ballista. Probably not very accurate. Pretty G. Damn, are we too late? Not yet, the restoration takes time. We can stop her. You want some? Come on, bring it. Uh, he, um, yeah, he gets the first turn battle for some reason. The, this guy is supposed to, was the bonus boss of the previous game, one of them at least. The one hidden in the first town. Flash bang. Disarm. Curse of... No, let's use Blood Barrier. Damn. He knows which pe... The AI always knows who's the most wounded, huh? That's how it seems like. Phalanx. Curse of Agony. Okay, Home Splitter. Party Brew. Already disarmed you. I restrike. Brilliance. A 
interruption. Every slash. Reap spirit. No! See, party brew and hope for the best. Highly doubt will heal in time. Divine shield. Hmm. No, I should tr stack this arm again. Reap spirit. I re slash while our magic is still high enough. Yeah, these don't seem to proc at all. Okay, we're almost there. Greater Brew, Every Slash, Reef Spirit. Got him. But why did he join the cult? He didn't seem to be part of the cult back then, he was just sitting beneath the city. And we're too late. I've done it, at last, now I can summon... Gah, no! Game's over, asshole. You lose. But the Vulcan Stone is dangerous. How do we need to destroy it somehow. You worthless piece of shit. You double-crossing bastard. What the hell is wrong with you? Whose side are you on? Lisa, please, let us help you. Please. No, I don't need help. Get away from me. We're leaving, Hermes. Aren't you gonna arrest her or something? Or okay. Taking away the stone will not bring her back to her senses. The wheels have changed her in motion, brother. You can't stop it. Nobody can. Goodbye, sister. Why did he son? I thought you were going. We were going to capture her and figure out exactly how she went mad. We have the Vulcan stone now, but the question is, what do we do with it? That was anticlimactic. She didn't even put up a fight. Ray just bitch slapped her and took the stone. Like strife was the was the main was pretty much the pretty, all they had at the last line of defense. Lysandra herself didn't even try to fight us. It grants wishes, right, or something like that. We could just wish for money or something. No, it's evil. Remember? Didn't you hear literally all the lore about it corrupting its user? Or to be back on the surface. That won't work, unless you want to become an all-powerful demon. In which case, go right ahead. Huh, I wouldn't wish for that. That would be the cost of granting your wish, dear. The Woken Stone is cursed. Mankind learned that the hard way when they discovered it a millennium ago. That's why it was separated into two pieces. But even a single piece is apparently really bad. And even that basic separation was motivated by greed. They wanted to have their cake and eat it too. And what should we do with it? We can't keep it safe forever. Let me guess, we're going to find the volcano and chuck it. I'll hold on to it. In the meantime, we have to find a way to destroy it permanently. I really hope Hermes doesn't try to use it to wish for Lysandra to go back to normal or something, because then we'll have to figure out how to bring him back to normal. This temple was built by the elves, right? Maybe they'll know something. That's a good point. They do have a village nearby. Let's pay them a visit. Thank you for guiding us here, Hermes. That said, you did mislead us, so we still can't trust you. Why did you change sides so suddenly? Like, literally this entire, uh, this entire dungeon could have been skipped if you didn't give it to Lysandra. I understand. If you don't mind, I would li I'd like to stay with you. I have no reason to be here. There's nothing I can do for her. I have to accept that. I see. He, uh, he, he, at some point, he decided to give up on her, but why did he change his mind so suddenly? 
I'll allow it, but we'll be keeping an eye on you. If you break our trust again... Let's just say it's not me you'll have to worry about. In my tribe, traitors are thrown off the cliff without mercy. Consider yourself lucky, Hermes. You won't get another chance. Uh, yeah, that guy was pretty tough, since he can inflict all kinds of debuffs. You have to win before he can inflict too many on you. Even at level 31, it, it was not easy. Seriously, that's such an anticlimactic way to uh, to deal with Sandra. She's obviously g uh, going for the same thing as Typhus. We need to get to the bottom of this. We need to interrogate her somehow. Figure, figure out who she's co been contacting. Figure out who's pulling her strings. Hopefully we can actually uh, do something this time. You need to speak with Elder Tiamat? Right this way, please. This is indeed Straza's imprint. How is she? And you're a palette swap of Typhus Jr. Great, she's up in Helonia right now helping us get used to living with dragons again. Do you know her? I have faith, faint memories of her, yes. It was but what point we first met. She and my father were great friends. He has since passed away. Thank you for saving the Burden Temple. I will mourn for the lives lost there in time, but it seems we have a more pressing matter. Show me the stone. This is not good. The Vulcan stone contains immeasurable power. It is the relic from which my father's brother, the one you, you know as Typhus, gained his power. What? The stone... Wait, so that's- this is what caused- so maybe the relic- the Vulcan Stone somehow connects the user to Lilith's master. But Lysandra already seemed to be influenced by it, so what's going on? Is there a way to destroy it? Hmm, yes. Legend says the stone was forged deep within the bowels of Mount Vulcan. Just as it was created there, it can also be destroyed. Yup, volcano time. Prove your worth to me as you have to Straza and Naitaka. The door here leads to the Tower of Trials. Meet me there. I'll be waiting. I've informed the shopkeepers to sell you their goods. I would recommend paying them a visit if you have the gold. The Underworld was once a desolate wasteland. Over a millennium ago, elves from the surface constructed a burned temple so that life could flourish here as well. That's why we have such a grassy biome in the, in the underground. Okay, everything's discounted now, too, including the final... The final alcohol. Okay, will we get anything from Uno about him? One of each... Hand over one of each beverage at Alki Hall. Aha, now we're in business. I can't wait to taste each of these and reverse engineer them. That was my true goal all along, you see. As promised, here are your rewards. 400G Miracle Nut Berserker Emblem. Need a drink? I can provide. So I can buy them all from here. But there's no dialogue with Uno, even though th these two are supposed to know each other. Thanks for tuning in to this Let's Play of Night Bewitched 2. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, subscribe, and or hit the bell icon.